This is part two of the Australian Haystacks Solar Garden project overview. What is an on-bill credit and how does it get paid? The on-bill credit are the technical term for a dollar amount that will be on your electricity bill. It will discount the total amount you need to pay for electricity, reducing your bill. The next question is, what's the expected return or saving? The estimated on-bill credit from participating retailer energy locals is $505 per year for 10 years as an on-bill credit for solar gardeners. This is based on an equivalent feed-in tariff of $0.12 cents per kilowatt. The original electricity retailer project partner announced in October 2020 was Innova Community Energy. Innova ceased operating in mid-2022 and was replaced by Energy Locos as the participating retailer. Energy Locos are Australian 100% based and operated, providing individuals, small businesses and large commercial enterprises with clean, reliable and cost-effective energy. Project members, solar gardeners, will need to switch to energy locals if it is different to their current provider. Over time, there may be multiple retailers to choose from, but to start off there will be an agreement with one. This will enable you to receive an electricity bill with your credit from your plot in the solar garden itemized next to your electricity usage. Can organizations or businesses buy a plot? A non-profit can become a member of the co-op if they pay an electricity bill in their name and then receive the on-bill credits, just like an individual member will. However, one person will need to be nominated as the representative in the co-op. Memberships of the Solar Garden are only offered to households and non-profit organizations. The next question is, where is the Solar Garden? A development application has been submitted for the proposed solar array to be built on a farm in the locality of Grongrong, east of Narandera in the Riverina of New South Wales. This location was chosen due to the relationship with the farmers, who are keen supporter of community-owned renewables. Importantly, it is close to the electricity distribution lines, meaning that the connection to the grid is relatively straightforward. Why a cooperative? Cooperatives are people-centered organizations that are owned, controlled, and used by their members. A cooperative's main purpose is to benefit its members. In this instance, the main benefit will be reduced electricity bills to the Haystack Solar Garden Co-op members. Cooperatives are based on the value of self-help, self-responsibility, democracy, equality, equity, and solidarity. A cooperative has been chosen as the business model to own and operate a solar farm so that the community can own the Haystack Solar Garden through participation, engagement, and investment, ensuring that the benefits remain local over the long term. How do I join? To become a member, visit the Haystack Solar Garden website and complete the membership application form. You will also be able to download the Haystack Co-op Rules and Disclosure Statement. What if I move interstate? Through the retail partners, energy locals, Members can be from Southeast Queensland, New South Wales, Victoria, Australian Capital Territory, South Australia, and Tasmania. How will preferences for solar plot be decided if oversubscribed? Riverina residents will have first preference, then those without solar in other parts of New South Wales in chronological order of membership application, then those with solar in chronological order of membership application. What carbon or greenhouse gas emission outcome do I get from this project? 
Haystack Solar Garden seeks to mimic a three kilowatt solar system on your roof, fully exporting to the grid. As a collection of three kilowatt plots totaling one megawatt of solar array, will be eligible to sell this exported solar energy as certified renewable energy and generate large generation credits (LGCs). As this is not a time-of-use project for the Haystack members themselves, there will be no carbon offset potential for the members' own energy used at home. But it does contribute to the greater transition to renewable energy and significantly in unlocking this new ownership model.